Hello and welcome back to the hen house. How the hell yeah, yeah yeah. I recently got some happy mail and I want to share. I want to share the love. Yes, I do. Um, this here is from Villa Beautiful. It is from my Miss Put Put. I love you, girl. And inside, she has purchased me another Villa Beautiful pen because I love them so much. And she's just the best in the world. So this is the Crystal VB pen. It is in black and white. I don't remember the name of it. But this is stunning. I have not opened it yet. So let me try to work with me here. Is there a sticker? I don't want to ruin it. No. Okay. I'm not sure if the pen comes with a refill or if she added the refill, but I got a refill for the pen. Look at that. Oh, love it. And it does have a wax bugger. So it shows you that it's unused. How awesome. How easy peasy is that? Like, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Pup Pup. I absolutely love this and I can't wait to use it use it. I'm choking on myself. So I got a pen and a refill. This is the shipping label. And it came with a card that is absolutely beautiful. And thank you, thank you, thank you. Pretty much love this. Go to shopvillabeautiful.com Yeah. And I got this little sticker sampler. <laughs> so cute. I love it. Thank you, Pot. Mwah! Love it. And this here is from one of my viewers. I don't know her screen name. Um, but her first name is Charlotte. So, Charlotte, thank you. Thank you, thank you. And these are just some stickers from Create With Pen. Look at these. So adorable. Uh, paper Bits Co. Little laundry baskets. Second sheet of that. Paper and milk. Some laundry and socks. So cute. A little sample from Every Minute a Story. Love it. Another one from Every Minute a Story. And then there's all kinds of these. Uh, Fruity Sticker Co. Face Masks. Work. Bath. Me Time. Lazy Day. We all need some of those. Relax. Relax. Laundry. No, thank you. <laughs> Laundry. I should probably turn these around so I can do it this way. Um, clean. Read. Read. Need lots of those. Coffee time. Oh, yeah. And there is two of those. Coffee, which is a little bit different. Plan, 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 plan. Plan, 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 plan. Grocery shopping. I absolutely love this. Love these. And grocery shopping. Thank you. Thank you, Charlotte. Mwah! These will definitely get used. I love it. I love me some happy mail. And then this is from Miss Beth. I didn't clean my thing yes from yesterday's CMP unboxing. Um this is the floriography. And let me tell you, this book is beautiful. Beautiful. There is her little note. She got this for me from Amazon. And I just keep flipping and flipping through this. You got your table of contents, dedication, introduction, which is, there you go, flowers. This is all flowers. Let me see. You don't really need to see the page number, so I'll scooch that down a little bit. And this, guys, oh, I want a second one. <laughs> so I can pull it apart. This is definitely staying intact because it's gorgeous. Uh, there's so many different kinds. 
Begonia. Belladonia. Blue Bell. Buttercup. Oh, Buttercup's are my favorite. You remember when you were little? I'm not sure. Okay, look at this page. Buttercup. Okay. When we were little, we used to see if we liked butter by sticking the buttercup underneath your chin. And if it glowed yellow, you liked butter. If it didn't, you didn't. Simple little kid things we did. <laughs> Love it. Oh. Cornflowers. Cowslip. They are alphabetical, which is so awesome. Dandelion. Is it a... Um, a weed or a wish you determine depends on your mindset dandelions are always wishes and it drives me nuts when my lawnmower man just like plucks them oh some fox glove which is very dangerous to cats i will let you know that gladiolas i have some fox glove in my backyard there i am yeah, in case you didn't know, I was named after a flower. Yes, I was. <laughs> Hellborn. Hemlock. Holly. Hanasako. Hyacinth. I have these in my garden. I can't keep a hydrangea alive to save my life. Irises I have. Lots of ivy everywhere. Jasmine, lady slippers, people, these have been deemed, um, like an illegal plant to pluck, and it's been a wise tale for years and years and years, but here in New Hampshire, it is not true, but the best thing about that rumor going around is they have flourished, so they're everywhere, and they're a very inappropriate looking flower, I must say, <laughs> it looks like male, um, testicles when you'll come upon them it's creepy marigold mint so it's also got you know the um, herbs as well as just flowers oh excuse me Peonies. I love peonies, guys. They get ginormous. Petunia and a puppy. Go back this way. Whoops. I definitely recommend this book. It is so cool. It's not like overbearing with information, which is wonderful. It's quick. It's to the point, And you definitely... Don't need to worry about not knowing something. And you can always Google and uh, search for more information on these. But it's perfect. <clears throat> I love this book. I can't stop flipping through it. Every time I do, I find something new to look at. And it's crazy because I've been through this entire book six or seven times but I still and then it's got this is really cool part bouquets for friendship and it tells you all the flowers that are in it for courting for marriage for sympathy regret and sorrow I'm sorry guys my stomach is like screaming for an apology Forgotten obligations, warnings, better ends, new beginnings, and then the acknowledgments and index. So it's so easy for you to find what you're looking for. And I like that it gives you, um, excuse me. Grief and sympathy. It'll show you all the flowers for that heartbrokenness to warning and parenting childhood. It's just cool. Then it ends with two blanks and your cover papers, which are absolutely beautiful. I wish I had this to scrap with. So there you go, guys. There's that. 
It is a Rue, R O U X, uh, Floriography, an Illustrated Guide to Victorian Language and Flowers by Jessica Rue. Yes. Thank you, Miss Beth. Mm -hmm. I love it. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little itty bitty happy mail. I love every bit of it, guys. I, I feel so special and blessed to have you guys in my life. I love it. I love you. And I can't thank you enough. So, yay! Like, share, subscribe on your way out. Don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any videos. Thank you for coming by, guys. I love y'all. Bye now.